this guys is the house pet if you will I just saw um this is my brother my brother's patternless leopard gecko and um yeah I just thought I'd make a video about her since we've had her for quite a while and uh just realised I hadn't done a video on her and um I mean, you're probably never really going to get a good shot of her face because she is quite an active gecko. She's not like super tame like quite a few other geckos, but so you might see my hand just in the way a bit sometimes. Come on, look at that face. Um, so it starts out a few years ago when my brother we wanted something different other than spiders in the house. So, um, and it just kind of became, and, uh, my brother wanted to be the one who kept it, and so he researched a bit, and the, the, uh, the uh, lizard he wanted was a bearded dragon, and everyone loves them, um, but then he found out that, you know, he, I mean, my brother's like, nine ten years old and back then he was like eight or nine so he thought that a bearded dragon will be a, a fit he, he thought that the bearded dragon was going to be too much work for him and um so i did more research and went to the local pet store and we got one of these guys little patternless leopard gecko um her name is lisa she is a female leopard gecko um she is and as I've and as I've mentioned already, she's not exactly my own personal lizard. This is my younger brother's. And um, if you, if you look, also a little bit of a bigger story. If you remember that uh, crested gecko that I showed you in that now deleted video, well, uh, that uh, crested that uh, crusty unfortunately died uh, a few years ago as well. And um, and it was kind of my fault because I was feeding her something she wasn't ex exactly used to, and so um, and um, uh, because she was used to like a fruit baby food mix, and the odd the odd cricket or mealworm or two, and um. But I tried giving her the uh, uh, Rapashi Crested Gecko Dye that everyone feeds uh, Leopard Geckos these days. No, I don't want you to be running around the cables there, Lisa. Come on. Come here. Um, so I tried feeding her that, but she just came used to it and she just used it. She just, she just kept eating like little drops and bits of it. And she eventually died, and it was kind of my fault. So I've been banned from keeping my own lizards. But um, um, it's kind of made me hearty not being able to have a second chance, chance at keeping these wonderful creatures. Uh, she lives in a she lives in a wooden vivarium with uh, glass sliding doors. I'll show you that when I go when I go put her back in a minute. Um, she lives on a diet of uh, mealworms. And uh, yeah, she's she's quite tame. Although she although she is quite energetic, she will she does she does like to scurry around. She's not like super tame. Like if she if she if she won't like stay still for long on your hand. If you try to um, if you try to um, hand if you try to uh, handle and get a good camera shot of her face. She won't stay still on your hand for too long, but uh, she lives on a diet of mealworms and calcium. Um, and yeah. I mean, I mean, this was kind of like my backup choice if I, I was if I was to ever get anything else than a crested gecko when I got my crested gecko. Um, 
this was my this was my backup of one of these leopard geckos. I mean, I mean, but and then you ask what 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 morph? What uh, morph is your favourite? I mean, I do love these guys. These are my favourite kind of gecko. Um, although Patmos isn't my favourite morph, I my my personal favourite morph are my personal favourite morphs of these guys are just nor or normal high yellow. Um, Max Snow, Max Snow Enigma, and any of the giant leopard gecko, the, the uh, giant morph, because they're cool. Um, but I love all those guys, all of those people, and I do love leopard geckos. And um, if I was if I was to ever, you know, get back into lizards, get my own personal lizard, because as I've said, this isn't my own lizard. Uh, this is my brother's. Uh, this will this will be the uh, ones that I keep, the ones that I would start with, and um, yeah, she's a cutie. Um, she is a female. Whoops. And um, we got her from a pet shop. We've never actually got any um, any uh, geckos from uh, online. I mean, I know you can find like more morphs on from uh, uh, online uh, dealers and all, but um, just to, to start off with, our, all of our starter geckos came from uh, pet shops because um, we we, 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 wanna, we uh, always want to be sure the gecko's health, and every time you uh, order online. Never really gonna get. Never really gonna get the opportunity to actually look at the uh, gecko you're purchasing, and um, this guy is actually used to handling. Uh, we are uh, we are uh, we are uh, we are uh, most we are uh, quite often we usually take it downstairs into the uh, front room, where we sometimes like to. Uh, just like let it crawl around, like to crawl all around the back of the furnitures, and we uh, we uh, managed to get it out eventually. But um, yeah, I do love these guys. But other than that, I don't really have to say. I don't really know what else to say. Other than the fact that I love her, we really love her, my brothers love her, and one of my parents love her. Pretty much everyone in my whole family. Loves her. I really do apologise not seeing much. It's just she's really, she's a really energetic. She's really curious. She's always moving. So yeah. But other than that, I mean, that's our. That's really our leopard gecko. And um, I think I'm going to pull her back in a minute. I don't want to keep her out too long. I don't want to, for her to get cold. I mean, just shows to show you that I'm not all big, hairy, scary spiders. I mean, I'm also into cute reptiles as well. I mean... Even with even with all my even with all my tarantulas, I mean it's not all big, hairy, and scary. I do love these cute guys. All right, I'm coming. I'm coming up to ten minutes now, so I'm I'm uh, gonna go uh, put it back now. I'll uh, be uh, back in a second. Sorry about this, guys. <coughs> I'm gonna make this quick. 
quick because we're back because my uh, iPad's low on charge. But um, here is my um, leopard gecko's cage. I mean, it says that it has a shedding stump. Heat mats on that side. And there she is. Calcium bowl, two hides in a water dish, and the uh, really nice varies. It's the uh, Viv exotic kind. And uh, yeah, but um, other than that, that's really all I have to say. So. I really do. I, I really do hope you've enjoyed her. I mean, we all love her. And um, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. And um, thanks for watching. See you next time.